Obviously, the big stories here are that they split up Roman uh, Roman Reigns and Cody. They're on separate brands right now to uh, keep them apart for the time being. All that talk about splitting up tag teams. They then changed their mind on Thursday, and all teams were going to be drafted as a unit. So the Street Profits did not get bro- broken up. And obviously, we have Bianca Belair going to Raw as SmackDown Women's Champion. So it looks like we're going to have to do another belt swap. And boy, yeah, did Rhea that Ripley. go great the first time around. Yeah, yeah, probably with Rhea Ripley going to uh, Raw. Although she's been on, she's actually on Raw. And then um, with Gunther going to Raw, in theory, that would mean Austin Theory would probably be going to SmackDown with Bobby Lashley. Kind of like, uh, there's some the switches, like you could see Bobby Lashley and uh, McIntyre, Edge on SmackDown. Um, you know, it's... I mean, they, you know, Viking Raiders going to Raw. Um, it's not um, Nakamura going to, to Raw. I mean, there's nothing. Um, I mean, I guess I guess it's probably better to evaluate it after the Raw show. I wouldn't be surprised, given that the Usos lost on SmackDown, that they end up on Raw and they split them up. So that way Raw does get the Usos. But then Owens and Zayn stay on SmackDown, or maybe they could all go, um, because that seemed like um, the tag match seemed like a blow off, and um, you know it's um, you know you would well it seemed like a blow off, but the storyline is that Roman Reigns wants them dead, and you know the story on the Raw, which which was kind of a bait and switch actually was all night Paul Heyman was telling Solo tonight's your night and Solo's taping up the thumb and you're waiting for him to take these guys out if they don't end up winning and they didn't win and and then the show just ended nothing happened so in order to continue the storyline well actually they don't really need to that because they announced that the draft is not going to affect until after backlash so they still have Monday Friday and backlash to blow that whole thing off and split they could have they could have um yeah they could they could blow that thing off on on the pay-per-view um and have solo turn on them at the pay-per-view yeah um but that'll all be pretty much explained tomorrow and um you know as far as the um people coming up from NXT um you know Isla Dawn and uh Alba Fire, uh, they didn't knock me dead on, um, you know, on uh, NXT. I actually thought that Casey Catanzaro and Caden Carter would have been better picks to come up. I think they have more potential on the main roster. Whether they're better all-around performers um, is a different question, but um, I think that they had more. I think they they have more for the main roster. JD is a great wrestler, but um, I wonder. I don't. I don't. He's one of those guys that I don't see doing well under Vince McMahon. Um, Von Wagner on the opposite side. I see him getting, you know, wherever he winds up. I see him getting being one of those guys who gets a push, uh, but he's going to have to show a lot more, um, or or he's not going to. I don't know. I don't know that he's ready. Indy Hartwell. We'll see. Zoe Stark probably ready. Um, Natalia being moved. It'll be interesting on the. Uh, I mean the. Um, I guess some of the key people. It'll be interesting to see. You know, Ronda Rousey and Shayna Baszler where they wind up. Um, probably on the same brand, I'm going to guess, with Raquel. Well, maybe not. I mean, because Raquel uh, Rodriguez and Liv Morgan probably could go back and forth. And, um, you know, so uh, that would be some of the key people. Charlotte Flair is another one. Brock Lesnar, of course. Um, Those would be the key people for tomorrow. But, I mean, as far as uh, if you look at the Raw side and Raw getting the new championship, you know, it kind of looks like, uh, and Seth Rollins also is another one for, for Monday. You know, I mean, the key people, um, as far as that, that have not been drafted, I mean, we got Gunther, but he's Intercontinental Champion, so I don't think that, that they'll put him in a the tournament, but they may. Um, of course, Cody Rhodes, uh, who would be the favorite, and Drew McIntyre, who may not be, I have to find out, like, when he is going to be ready, um, you know, with his injury and everything like that, but he would be another guy who would be a key guy. I mean, if there's going to be a feud with Cody Rhodes, um, they could do something with Cody Rhodes and Drew McIntyre because um, Lesnar is going to just be this pay-per-view. And then, um, you know, then as far as somebody else, um, you know, they, uh, again, you know, Seth Rollins, but Seth's a baby face and he's not going to turn at this point. 
And the, the other one is uh, nothing on Bray Wyatt whatsoever. Nope. So a lot of people have asked about him. And the other thing is, is not just Bray Wyatt, but no Alexa Bliss. And Alexa Bliss is ready to return. So if that tells me that they still have plans for Bray Wyatt and Alexa Bliss together, because if they didn't have any plans for them, Alexa Bliss would probably be uh, back and had been dra- would have been drafted in this thing, and she was not. Loading up on some liquid energy here. Uncle Howdy. Why does he do this? Why does he do this? <laughs> That's like the Uncle Howdy thing. Why You're does he do that? me to explain Uncle Howdy. Yes. Someone needs to put that to music, some 70s song, for the best of the Brian and Vinny show. Yeah, keep it off this show, please. Why does he do this? Why does he do this? That's like the Uncle Howdy thing. We're going to get kicked off whatever run. You just disgusted Granny. That's like the Uncle Howdy thing. What a jamming song that is. Yeah, keep it off this show, please. If you enjoy these videos, for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of the Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, the Mad Men Podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.